Hi Gemini, welcome back to our Enigma. Let's see your messages between May 16 to 22. This is going to be a general message. Take what resonates and what does not resonate. For personal readings, white spells, premium charge crystals, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. All the details are even down below in the description box under this video. And my Instagram is ionigma.in. You can follow me there. Let's see. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus sign in Gemini. Plus, first watchers, May 16 to 22. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? What's going to happen? All right. All right. Oh, my gosh. The moon card. Someone is missing you. Feeling really sad, stressed out, hurt, wants to talk to you, feels like forced to give up on you, but doesn't want to give up on you. This is someone that's still hopeful, despite of no contact, no communication, or nothing working out. This is someone that has deep emotions to you. They're just not feeling good. Maybe they deceived you in the past, and now they've realized what they did wasn't acceptable. This could be a cancer that's missing you like crazy. Three of Pentacles. There was an energy at third party that created a big misunderstanding between the two of you. It also did uh, turn into a love triangle that caused this ending. They, they miss you for sure. They miss you. They want to work this connection out. I'm seeing them constantly calling and messaging you trying to fix things in the next three months or next three weeks. Wow, can this get any better than this? Just in the beginning of the read, it's talking about marriage. This person this time wants commitment. Now, let me see why is this person not talking or why you are not talking to this person? What happened? Three of Pentacles is the question, basically. Okay, Gemini. Somewhere you don't see a future here with this person. You're extremely goal-oriented, career-oriented. What happened between the two of you? I feel like this person is not financially on the same page. They can't provide. This person is also someone that was depending on you for your money. There were lies, actually. Was, there were lies. What kind of lies was this person speaking? Oh, I feel like because this person is too free or... They like it when they talk to some random people. They were not having any relationship with anyone, but they just liked the attention that they got from the opposite sex. So um, behind your back, I feel this person was talking to some random people for fun. You find found out and they lied to you and you walked away because you have your life purpose to focus on, your career to maintain. You cannot allow yourself to get you know, caught up with these things. So for you, it's like you're more mature. But this person doesn't meet you on the same page. You decided and walked away from this person. And now since there's no communication, they've made up their mind. They're going to stay extremely loyal towards you this time when you guys connect. This is someone that is not able to take this no contact. Whoever this is, they're not liking it. I feel they want marriage right off the bat. They just want to marry you. This is the energy that I'm getting. Then I'm seeing there's this eight. Oh my gosh. Eight of wands. They are about to communicate this to you real soon. Fast communication, guys. Someone is coming towards you faster than the speed of light. Just kidding. They're coming so fast that they're not able to control their senses. And they're like, you say anything, I'm going to do it for you. This is how the person's energy right now is. They're highly sensitive, highly emotional. You make them do anything, they'll do it for you. Because they cannot think of losing you. Why do they want you now? There's something about your beauty. It keeps flashing in their, you know, in their mind and they cannot stop thinking about you. Something about you so mesmerizing your, persona your personality is different. Uh, the justice. I feel this person knows that what you did was absolutely right. And the fact that you spoke up for yourself, you stood up for yourself and you reacted the right way, you confronted this person has got this person's focus towards you. I feel like they've never respected you this much as they do it now because you said something to this person in return of being disrespected. And now they can sense that you're not an ordinary person to deal with. You're not a person to be messed up with. They want to make up to you this time. 
so the tower and the justice they want to fix things okay they know you are honest and your honesty is making them crazy they are extremely guilty they want to fix things so i'm seeing the two cups all they want is just you and them they are wishing universe they're begging and they're doing everything to get you back in love with them and they see they feel they sense a soulmate bond with you and they're not able to let go of you and they're ready to leave everyone but they cannot leave you that's the energy i can see them being in so this time they want to assure you that they just want you and them and nobody else okay so this is someone that is going to fulfill all your wishes this time if you ask them for anything if you tell them to leave their parents they'll also do that for you that's how strongly connected they feel towards you extreme love it's like you own this person's heart they've given you the everything this person sees your wish come true everything that they want okay is you so the major wish with the nine of cups so this is someone that is hesitating to come towards you they know what they did and now they want to fix things they don't know how to start where to begin with but they have a lot to say they don't want to rush and create mess again so they want to go slow they're coming towards you and this time they want to put a ring on they want to tell you that i want to put a ring on you or this person is coming with a ring so either ways i'm saying they are so afraid to lose you that this person will immediately ask you for a commitment when they come towards you let's see what's going on in their mind right now i'm seeing they are receiving a lot of love offers as well but they are saying no to all of those offers because of you gemini wow yeah see they know they were at wrong they want to fix things they want to be back with you they want they are apologizing they're not a bad person i don't see that so they were just taking you for granted because you didn't say anything to them and now that you said it this person is like oh i know i did this wrong and i have to make up to this and this time this person is coming with this energy of i have to win this gemini no matter what happens they are my so this connection can definitely work out this time okay yes earlier it was just like you you guys were getting to know each other so there were a lot of disappointments but this this time this person wants to make things happy okay the way you want yes this person will do everything that lover would do so this person really loves you they have feelings for you they will never deny it and they can do anything you want them to they're coming with an engagement date <laughs> they're announcing their wedding see i told you there's a reconciliation happening this person is your soulmate they know this thing they have understood they never told you how much they had feelings so you they were just like they wanted some freedom and now that you left they are not able to deal without you so they are coming back blame they have been blaming you and hurting you this person is ready to take the blame on themselves because they were wrong they know this thing you are their happiness you are the person that they feel the most connected or even more than their parents or more than the people that they have met before you you are the only person they feel deeply connected to and they have been imagining you guys coming together i feel like this person is doing some manifestation imagining okay in their head for the reconciliation they've been like visualizing you guys coming together so you're in their imagination all the time okay go the distance i'm seeing them making efforts towards you someone is 47 here but they're making efforts towards you for sure i'm seeing that happening so how are you going to react to this write down the comment section when this person comes in i'm also wanting to see your feelings towards them let's see after this justice so justice is being served you taught them a lesson and now they're ready to take on with a complete new beginning as a new person wanting to settle down have a responsibility and get married and have kids and be with you forever so the connection just became stronger guys congratulations their feelings so you just grew yoga and teaching some of you are meant to be yoga teachers some of you are into teaching or yoga really helps you revive yourself and show your best potential you're meant to be teachers i feel uh that's your life purpose so you might be doing yoga side by side it's helping you keep uh in you know stay strong because you stood up for yourself this person is like vulnerable and weak in front of you they know you were right all the time the world it feels like when this person comes towards you you will feel like as if the universe is 
heard you. The world is at your feet. Everything you ever wanted has come to you. It's just, it's like a shocking surprise. When this person comes in with this new chapter, let's open a new chapter. Let's start a new beginning. They will fulfill all your wishes. This person is ready to move mountains for you. You can see this, the world, your world is going to definitely shift. Gemini, mark my words. So I want to see your feelings towards this person after this. Let's see. You. you guys are coming together for sure. Yes, you can see this person has changed. You changed them. Expect a powerful change, okay? Let me see your feelings for them right now. How are you feeling for them? Your feeling towards them is like they have to make efforts. If they don't make effort, I'm done. You are by the time you're just simply focusing on your life purpose and goals. You are really working hard for being a sensation. You want to be growing. You want to be heard. You want to be loved. You want to be respected. So you're working on it. I'm seeing you have mixed feelings. You're not sure you want to be with this person. Sometimes you're like, no, it's too much of work. I don't want to be with this person. So you're in these two minds right now because this is someone that you feel is non-reliable or too amateur to deal with. The advice for you is your love life is shifting. Wear a rose quartz. You can get from me a pure energized rose quartz to help you shift the energies between you and this person and let them know that you're the only one so your love life is getting renewed guys don't worry it's going to another level higher level okay they're changing i'm seeing change is a major thought so they're thinking about you a lot they want to change themselves for you they're ready to come towards you the new love offer completely new person you won't believe that this is a person that you are dealing with they may also be painting your pictures okay if they're not a good painter they're painting in the head but yes there will be a sexual union is also i'm seeing you guys will be hugging each other tight this is your soulmate you help them grow and you will surrender and leave it to this person i mean you will surrender yourself and open up to this person now signs this person could be or whoever is coming towards you this is not happening in your life this is about to happen so you're about to meet your twin flame Leo, Virgo, Gemini, most probable sign, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. All right. So now let us see from Aries to Pisces your person's feelings for you, Gemini. Aries towards Gemini. They're trying to manipulate you to get back with you, which is not a good energy. Don't trust them. Taurus, this person is so shy and scared, like they don't want to lose the friendship or whatever little that you guys have left with, but they want to marry you. Gemini. Gemini wants a new beginning. They have been talking to a lot of people, but all they want is you and to manifest you. Cancer. They see you changing every minute. They see you growing. Cancer is overtly protective towards you. They want to marry you and take care of you. This could be an alpha. Leo. This is someone that is highly attracted towards you, loves being around you, and keeps complimenting over your looks. Virgo. This person has been stalking and feel like you're, oh my gosh, you're so strong. They're in shock that they've never seen so strong and powerful person like you. Libra. Did we do that? Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo. Let me just do the Virgo again. I don't know if I've done this. Okay, Virgo is definitely fallen in love with you, but they're trying to control themselves so that they're in, in their senses. They've been watching you. Libra. The Libra person cannot take the fact that you walked away and they're coming back. They're feeling passion. They're also trying to change themselves appearance-wise to impress you this time. Scorpio. They're intimidated by you. They feel like you're too, too straightforward and they got scared. So this person is right now wanting some time off so that they can calm themselves down and come towards you. Maybe you need to be lighter on this person right now. Sagittarius. All right, the Sagittarius is very, very, very into you, okay? This person is not going to let you be with anyone else. They will have you by hook or by crook. This person also wants you to be happy, but always worried that you might date someone else. They see you as their soulmate. Capricorn. They have been wishing to get back with you, okay? They fear rejection or they feel really bad for rejecting you or whatever happened in the recent past. They see you as someone that's special for them. 
Aquarius. They're trying to walk away from you, but your thoughts keep coming back into their mind, stopping them from taking this action every time. Pisces. Oh my gosh, this person sees you as one and only. They want to marry you and spend the rest of their life with you. Nathan. Yeah, they're heartbroken, they're hurt, they're sad, they're depressed. You are also not very happy without this person or just simply being alone. But you're taking good care of your health. You're eating good, fresh foods. Um, I'm seeing avocado. You just had that. Yes, I'm seeing you are connecting yourself with nature. You're doing all the things that are real and authentic. You like to stay real. You're going to celebrate someone's wedding and event is coming in. Someone from India, America, West Indies, New Zealand. Someone is a dietitian here or taking a diet, trying to change yourself. Anthony could be the name. T and D could be the initials. T, A, D, T, and N. These are the initials or the letters in either of your names. And again, Natalie, Natasha. Someone's from Argentina. Someone's name is Norton. Andy and Netherlands I'm seeing Netherlands something like Notting Hill your person is more tanner darker skinned they're not able to accept that it's over they want you back Whereas for you, it's like you think that it's done. And you're still like looking for love. I'm seeing the pink color again, which means there's another indication that universe is saying you need a rose quartz. It's pink in color, that's why. I'm seeing you're more focused on improvising your appearance and feeling good, looking good. You smell different. You have something like unusual to your fragrance. And I'm also seeing that you're feeling more attractive than ever before. Someone's from Antarctic, Antarctica, Atlanta, Toronto. Denmark, someone's name is Danny, Jane. Some of you, this person is your tenant. But I'm seeing you feeling more attractive because you feel lighter. You've been taking good care of your diet. Oh, wow. Yes, you're running, you're going for a walk, or you're taking up some gym sessions. Uh, you're doing stuff to make yourself feel fit. Hardy could be the name. Someone is a doctor here. I'm hearing antidote, something like antidote. You're an antidote to this person. Their life is just going messed up right now. They can't think straight. You guys can meet on social media if you haven't met this person yet, but I'm also seeing this is someone that's going to reach out to you on social media and keep on constantly messaging and commenting or stuff like that. They just don't want you to forget them. Some of you are going to celebrate on social media. You could be an athlete on social media, an influencer on social media, some kind. And uh, yeah, you're attracting people with your nature, with your body, with the celebrations you do on social media. This is also what I'm seeing. Albert. Tokyo, someone's from Tokyo. I'm hearing someone's name is Daisy. I'm hearing midday. Midday, that's when this person calls or messages you or you meet. Camel. I'm getting too many charms. You're so independent. I'm seeing again, there's a pink here. The three pink, that's a very clear message for you, Gemini. Get a rose quartz for yourself right off the bat. Okay, make sure it's pure. 
but get it okay and the rose quartz that you're getting um, it should be a bracelet form all right so that is about it i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read thank you for your time please do like share comment and subscribe bye